Do you feel like you're spending way too much time editing videos in CapCut? Dragging clips into the timeline, splitting them, adjusting the speed, it can be tedious and time consuming. But what if we told you there was a way to fly through your CapCut workflows and edit videos 100x faster? In this video, we'll be showing you how to utilize CapCut's powerful yet hidden keyboard shortcuts to streamline your editing process. Whether you're slicing clips precisely or syncing things up to the beat of the music, these shortcuts will have you zipping around the editor like a pro. Say goodbye to excessive clicking and scrubbing, with these CapCut Pro tips, you'll have fast and efficient video edits every time. Welcome to Creative Suit Tutorials YouTube channel. Today we will show you the most important keyboard shortcuts to increase your video editing workflow up to 100x in CapCut PC. You can watch these keyboard shortcuts on the lower left side of screen. Note that we are using Windows so we will discuss shortcuts for this Windows CapCut. If some of you are using CapCut for Mac, you can use Command instead of Control key. Without any delay, let's look at the first shortcut. This is for importing new video clips in CapCut PC. To use this we can press Ctrl plus I. This will open us a new window for importing video clips. To import this to timeline, we can just click on this plus button. During editing we want to preview in full screen. To view the full screen, we can use the shortcut key as Ctrl, Shift and up arrow. To exit, we can simply press escape key. Next to split a video from anywhere, we have multiple options. We can simply set the pointer at desired location and use Ctrl plus B shortcut key. We can also simply press B to activate split tool and now we can add split at any location using mouse click. We can press A to activate the selection tool again. What if we have multiple clips and we want to split them all at a single point? Let's look at this. Now to split through all the clips on timeline, we can use Ctrl, Shift and B. Next if we have many split screens on the timeline and we want to select them all, we can use this shortcut. Press the square bracket key on the keyboard and now from the pointers either side we can select all the clips with just one click. This is very time saving shortcut when we want to add an effect to multiple clips at once. Now let's suppose we are on timeline and we want to preview our VED forward and backward. For this we can use J, K and L keys. We can simply press L and the forward preview will be started. If we press J, backward preview will start and to stop the preview, we can press K. Next key is to extract sound from the video clip. For this we can use Ctrl, Shift and S. This will extract the sound from the video clips. Now let's suppose we want to view a specific frame from video clip. For this we can use left and right arrow keys on keyboard. If we press them with shift, we can jump several frames instead of previewing single frame. If we press up and down arrow, we will land on the nearest split location and clip end. Next if we want to group two or more clips we can use Ctrl plus G. Now if we want to ungroup them, we can use Ctrl, Shift and G. If we select a clip and press Ctrl R, we will get to the speed control section. 
If we want to move to speed curve section, we can use Shift B. We can also use a shortcut key to create a compound clip. For this we can use Alt plus G. To undo the compound clip, we can use shortcut key as Alt, Shift and G. Now if we want to change the audio level of our video sounds, we can use the Ctrl plus dot or Ctrl plus comma shortcut key. If we want to expand our timeline to full zoom, we can use Shift plus Z shortcut key. To import a specific portion of a video to share with anyone, we can set the in and out point on timeline using I and O shortcut keys. Now we can just export this part of video. These were the most common shortcut keys which can increase our editing workflow by 100x. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more. Stay tuned for our next video, and until then, take care.